The countdown Our countdown to the world's most important plastics trade fair in Düsseldorf is in full swing. We gave ourselves the task of visiting the most innovative companies in plant and machine manufacturing and today we are the guests of Engel Austria in Schwertberg. Engel Austria GmbH was founded in 1945 and has its headquarters in Austrian Schwertberg. The company has a global presence with 9 production plants, 60 representatives and 29 sales and service branches. The company is led by Dr. Peter Neumann, Dr. Christoph Steger, Dr. Stefan Engleder and Klaus Siegmund. Around 5200 employees generate annual turnover of 1.25 billion euro with a manufacturer of injection molding machines, automization and integrated system solutions. Customers come from the automotive industry, technical injection molding, teletronics, medicine and the packaging industry. We'll meet Engel at the K-Trade Fair in Hall 15. During my visit to Schwertberg, I was welcomed by one of the board members, Dr. Stefan Engleder, who offered me deep insights into how he thinks Industry 4.0 will influence the future business of the plastics industry. We've addressed the topic for more than two years now and have structured everything under the title Inject 4.0. Inject 4.0 is Industry 4.0 here at Engel, with a focus on production, the smart factory. Of course, we are interested in the latest trade fair news. Can I learn something about that from you today? Yes, you can. To make everything a bit more accessible, because Industry 4.0 is often so visionary, we want to introduce you to two products. Here, for the measuring of screw wear, called the E-Connect Monitor, and here, a product for mold tempering called the IQ Flow Control. And we are allowed to film this with our cameras? Please be my guest. Happily. How important is service in the era of Industry 4.0? Service is ever more important and becoming smart. What does that mean, smart service? Smart service at Engel means we offer products and services which increase the availability of our plants. That sounds plausible, but doesn't that become more expensive for customers? No, it doesn't. With condition monitoring and predictive maintenance, we have the possibility to exchange components and wear parts only when it's really necessary. Simultaneously, we can maintain a Availability. And now my colleague Herr Capella can tell you how this works in practice. Great. I will head over there now. And we'll meet again at your trade fair booth at the K. Many thanks. Bye. Bye. Hello, Herr Capella. Hello, Herr Marshall. I've heard I can learn something about smart service from you. Yes, as you know, the subject of plant availability is a very important one. And unexpected downtimes in particular can cause very high costs. Maintenance, too, must be equipped for the future which means ensuring competitiveness. For these reasons, we developed a predictive monitoring solution called eConnect Monitor. So you generate data in the machine, which allows the owner to avoid downtimes preemptively? That's right. With eConnect Monitor, we integrate sensors into the machine, which can record the current status of process critical components, and that during ongoing operation. Like this here? This sensor is an ultrasound sensor, which we use to monitor the screws. The data from this sensor is transmitted to us via a secure connection, evaluated and analyzed there in an algorithm. And the customer logs into our customer platform eConnect and calls up the wear status, looks at what the remaining lifespan is, and based on that can plan exchanging the component in advance. That's cool. <laughs> the best is still to come. In the future, the machine will order replacement parts independently and can decide for itself if it needs a service engineer for the switch. That's how I imagine Industry 4.0. Me too. If you'd like to see a second Industry 4.0 solution, then you should pay Herr Balker a visit. I will do that now. Many thanks. Bye. Bye. To set the process optimally, one must have the mold tempering under control. Faulty mold tempering is still a reason for many faulty components in global injection molding production. Well, faulty parts are something you want to spare your customers, right? Exactly. Which is why Engel has addressed mold tempering for years now. 
New at the K, alongside our eFlomo device, is our eTemp device, an integrated tempering device in our machine control system. All the data from eFlomo and eTemp are displayed together, enabling them to be optimized together on one screen. We save power, which saves money, we reduce the risk of defective parts, and that, for us, is living in Jack 4.0. I've learned something new. Thanks for your insights. We'll meet again in Düsseldorf. Absolutely. Hello, Herr Dr. Steger. Hello, Herr Marshall. I've spent the whole day looking around and I get the feeling that Industry 4.0 has become part of your DNA in the meantime. This is correct. That's correct. We don't think about approaches to Industry 4.0, we live it, regardless of whether our customers require timely assistance systems or to connect their global production networks intelligently. We have the right answer with our Inject 4.0 modules. Very exciting. Yes, it is exciting. And today you've seen two highlights. Come to Hall 15 at the K and form your own picture of how these and additional modules grow together into a smart factory. Very happily. We'll meet again in Düsseldorf. Hey Marshall, it was a pleasure. Thanks. That was my day in Schwertberg at Engel, a company which impressed me deeply and not just in regard to Industry 4.0. If you like, we'll meet again for the next edition of Countdown.